Hi everybody. I got peace here. Dressed pretty warm because it is a little chilly outside. So chilly, I started a fire in the fireplace this morning. About 6 a.m. It was pretty cold. So we'll, we're going to go take a walk outside. And I'll bring you along. Okay. Said we did plant quite a bit. Got some more to plant there. The hyacinths. They were doing really well. I don't know if you can see them. They were doing really well, but not so much anymore. This light is really neat. Looks like a flame. <laughs> Sorry, I had to pause that real quick. The phone was ringing, and I thought I'd go ahead and put another log on the fire. And I think I'm going to lay peace down, and I'm going to go ahead, and I'll walk you around the yard. There's the others. I've got some herbs in the two long pots there. Got some pots in the front, too. Well, it's actually the front, but we always call it the backyard. I don't know why. Everybody uses the sliding door for to come in, I guess, anyway. This last year only had two lilies. There is actually nine coming up right here. And we've got this little new light glows blue and it's supposed to actually be a bug zapper <laughs> I didn't have a full charge last night so we'll see how it goes I'm hoping if I start over here first uh, might get to catch some birds they flew off when I came outside so here's where my three little girls are laid to rest I need three tweenies uh, that is wisteria coming up. I think we're going to go ahead and plant some of the flowers over here. Got a bunch of squirrels playing. And we planted these lilac bushes last year. They're doing wonderful. Wonderful, wonderful. This one's really tall. Almost as tall as me. So full this year. Wow. We had a snow here in April. I thought maybe it was going to really hurt these lilac bushes. Each one of these are a different kind. This one's already got a bloom on it. You want to pause this and take a smell. Oh, it smells so good. And a bunch of lilies. These are all lilies on the outside of this hole, which is full of flowers now, too. Was well, going to be a koi pond. The fountain we haven't got going this year yet. Oh, sure. Here's the other lilac. And the fifth one over there. So, we found this bucket. And this flowering pot put flowers in it. And this tree, I know it's not standing up straight, but he says that's the way it was in the ground. I would have straightened them up, but I think it's called a red bud or something. Um, before the green leaves come, it buds purple, purple flowers, and then the green leaves come. So, 
And we did plant a whole bunch more seeds here in the middle. They are just doing awesome. These will get much, much bigger. Those big leaves. get a lot bigger. Oh, that one we just passed over here. Actually three coming up on there. And we moved the birdhouses over here because the lilies at this top center, that big one and the long grassy looking type and the other one next to it never haven't done good because of the birds they would kick the seed out and then peck all over those plants so we decided to move it like that mosaic light broke I hope you guys can hear the birds. I love being out here in the country. And we do have some honeysuckle. It's going that way. All up here. I want to get some morning glories and get going along the fence. And all the bulbs we put in the hole here last year, they'll, they should come up too. Well, actually, I think we did it two summers ago, and a lot more came up last year. Can't wait till the flowers start coming. Tell you the birds absolutely love the fruit cakes. We've had a lot of rain, so it's looking a little funny right now, but yeah, they love that stuff. That's fun having the bird feeders right here next to the windows in the kitchen. Just look out there, and there's always birds. And the cats are having a lot of fun watching them too. So yeah, I just want to take you a little walk around the yard. Yeah, I'm not doing real good. That snow might have hurt them. I don't know, for some reason the hyacinths don't do real great out here. Must be the dirt. I'm going to have to go around and pick up all these little flower tags. And let's see, that one hanging wants to go out on the other side of the house. And we got two big flower pots full. So, yeah, well, thanks for coming out with me. I'm going to get back and tend to the fire. Don't know if the birds are going to come. They usually do with me. Now, if my husband's out here, they won't come and feed. But when it's just me, they do. So now I just backed up and they're already coming back. Let's see if we can go a little closer. can tell those four windows there in my kitchen and they just come 
Got a lot more Blue Jays this year and Cardinals. Oh, the flower seeds that we put. There's like five different packs. Five different kinds we, that we put out there in the hole there. Uh, they attract hummingbirds. Peckers this year too. A few different breeds of them. I was whistling back and forth to a cardinal. That's the loud one you might hear. That. <laughs> that banging you hear is one of the cats pawing at the glass door here trying to get me to let him out. Those are Papa Martins. They will eat a bunch of mosquitoes. If you get enough of them, you won't have any around the area they are. Well, I don't want you guys to get bored watching the birds, but I'm going to let you go. Thanks for watching. Everybody have a great day.